Hi there, this is James Swanick, and you're listening to the Alcohol Free Lifestyle Podcast, where you learn how to take back control over alcohol and live a life of health, wealth, love, and happiness. You are not an alcoholic. You don't need to go to an AA meeting and say, Hi, my name's John, my name's Tina, my name's Chris, and I'm an alcoholic, because you're not an alcoholic. Okay, don't let society tell you that you are. You're just someone who drinks too much at the moment, and we can easily take care of that. I'm James Swanick from the Alcohol Freedom Formula. I've helped tens of thousands of people around the world now quit drinking. There's some free resources for you down below. Click on those to get started. You're not an alcoholic, but you come home from work probably, and you have a couple of drinks at the end of the day to relieve you of your stress or anxiety. Or you go out on the weekend and you binge drink, and maybe sometimes you get drunk. Maybe you just have this seemingly innocent glass or two each night, and there's this silent destruction going on underneath the surface that's robbing you of clarity and focus and energy and a good night's sleep. Your drinking, however innocent it may seem, even if it's just one or two drinks, is causing you to be foggy. It's causing you to put on weight. It's causing you to stay in a state of mediocrity where you're not going after your dreams. You don't get that promotion at work. You don't make that extra call in your business. You don't do that additional deal. You're just blah. You're not rock bottom, but you're just blah. What are the alternatives or what are the options here for you to finally quit drinking and stay quit? Well, the knee jerk reaction from everyone is go to AA, go to Alcoholics Anonymous. Let me tell you something. I support AA in its mission to help people who feel like they are addicted to alcohol. And they have a 6 to 8% success rate. So less than 1 out of 10 people who go to AA will actually quit and stay quit. Now if you're still watching this, I've got a hunch about you. And that is, is that you do not want to go to an AA meeting and say, Hi, my name's John, my name's James, my name's Tina, Christine, Lauren, and I'm an alcoholic. Because deep down you know you're not an alcoholic. Do you really want to surrender to a higher power? Do you want to stand in a circle, hold hands and chant, work the system, it works if you work it, keep coming back, keep coming back, or whatever they say in AA. Now again, has it worked for millions of people around the world? Yes, it has, I support them for that. But it doesn't work for nine out of 10 people. And you're not an alcoholic and you don't need to drive to a d dirty, dark, dungeon-like meeting, stand in a circle and say that you are an alcoholic. You just drink too much, it's a habit, and you haven't figured out how to break that habit. Now, if you've been trying to quit and haven't been able to, it's okay, it's not your fault, because alcohol is highly addictive. It's a toxin, and it's a poison that leaves you wanting more of it the whole time. Plus, you're dealing with society, all these smiling assassins everywhere, who are coming up to you going, want a drink, have a drink? It's the the person who greets you at the restaurant when you first come in and he or she says to you, oh, good evening, your table's not quite ready, would you like to have a drink at the bar? The smiling assassin, they're like smiling, here, would you like some of our poison? They're trying to kill you with their poison but doing it with a smile on their face. When you get to the restaurant table, the waiter or waitress comes over and says, good evening everyone, my name's Christy, I'll be your server tonight, can I get you started with some drinks? They may as well be saying, can I get you started with some poison? May I offer you some attractively packaged poison right now? Because that's what alcohol is. It's a poison and the toxins stay in your body for seven to 10 days after you drink it. Sapping you of your energy, making your liver work overtime, drying out your skin, robbing you of clarity and focus and energy. Just because you know that you go out and have a couple drinks each night and you haven't been able to break that cycle does not mean that you are an alcoholic. If you would like to learn how to quit alcohol and break that habit and do it with support, do it with a proven methodology that I learned and that I followed back in 2010 and that now thousands of people have learned and incorporated into their own lives to successfully quit drinking without AA, then I invite you to click on some links down below, get some of my free resources, check it out, it will help you. Please do like this video as well, comment down below and let me know if people in your life has tried to convince you to go to an AA meeting. You're not an alcoholic. You're just someone who knows that you drink too much at the moment, but that's gonna change. You're not broken. You're not broken. You're not broken. You're just someone who has a habit of drinking a little bit too much, a little bit too consistently, and you realize that it's slowing you down and holding you back in life. So I invite you to click on the link below, grab some of those free resources, 
and live the life of alcohol freedom because it's beautiful on the other side. Please remember to subscribe, like, comment down below. I'll see you on the next one. Thank you so much for listening. I have some free stuff for you. If you go to jameswanick.com forward slash guide, I will send you my formula for reducing or quitting alcohol. If you'd like to watch the video versions of these episodes, then you can watch them at my YouTube channel, which is at James Swanick. If you'd like to send me a direct message on Instagram, you can do so at James Swanick. If you would like to try a three-day challenge, a free three-day challenge, you can go to jameswanick.com forward slash three-day challenge. If you would like to try the 30-day no alcohol challenge, you can go to 30-day no alcohol challenge. If you would like to schedule a 15-minute exploratory call with one of my coaches to see how we may be able to help you in your alcohol-free journey, you can go to jameswanick.com forward slash schedule. And my request is, if indeed you enjoyed this episode or you have enjoyed the podcast, would you please go ahead and rate the show in iTunes and would you please write a review? A review might just be a sentence saying, great, listen, hey, this was fantastic. Oh, I really enjoyed this. Whenever you give a rating, whenever you write a review, it surges our podcast up in the rankings, enabling more people to see it and hear it and potentially inspiring someone out there to reduce or quit alcohol and potentially transform their life. So yes, while it does help me to get ratings and to get reviews, you will actually be directly contributing to helping someone's life by having them discover this podcast. So if you are open to inspiring others and to helping me in the process, would you please go ahead and give this episode a ranking and would you please write a review? Thank you so much for listening and I will catch you on the next one.